Hello guys. That's better. <laughs> How are you doing today? So today, uh, it's going to be gathering as well as MSQ. Um, no, sometimes it's so easy to relax. I, I really like the gathering in this game. As well as the crafting. It's so de-stressful. It's brilliant. Really like it. So I've already done a leaf uh, that should give me a good amount of XP, like I didn't do it completely, uh, let's collect reward here, we're level 26 currently, and uh, we'll get some earth shards and a very very healthy amount of experience, will actually level me up to level 27, um, yeah, got actually some rings, um, at level 27 you can actually get some rings that give you more uh, gathering points, like GP, and that is actually quite quite useful. Also, we will be doing more of them. Now, I still have my first pick over here. As well as for the botanist, I'm currently level 15. So, this is what I'll do. We're going to be hitting level 30. We will. Uh, let's go fieldcraft. And I like the cat girl. I don't know if this is a good one. I don't think it is. I think cat girl is a good one. Uh, let's accept that. And you know, every every level has a zone. So this particular one with the where the deep dungeon is, uh, that is for the level twenty to thirty. Now on the internet, there's a whole bunch, whole bunch of information on where you should do the leaves. Like 1 to 10 is going to be Shroud or the Western Talalan. Um, just, just hop over to City State. If you reach, say, level 30. Just hop over to City State. See if you can find the... Um, what's it called? The Tradecraft. I think it's Tradecraft. For that particular level. It's always going by... Well, let's say 5, for till level 30 it's like 10, and afterwards it's 5, I believe, and then it comes 10 again, so just, just hop over every now and then, see if there's a better one for you to get. Yeah, it will cost you a tiny bit of money, but other than that, you know, why not? Why not? Now, I will also be picking up the fisherman. I really don't like the fisherman in the early games, what I do like is ocean fishing. But, you know, that, that's about it. That's about it. So, we go over there. And we'll start this particular gathering mission. I think we should be able to reach level 30 with it. Let's go to jobs. Initiate. To, to full level. I, I want as much as possible. We'll just see how good it is. And it is, it's just, see it as a mini, mini game, a very, very limited miniature game. So this is level 31, of level 32, it has a 30% chance. Now you can go with sharp vision, and it will cost you 250, and you will get a 50% increase. But I'd say we just go dirty cake stone, so the 100 GP should be enough to get a decent amount. Now you don't, you will get bonuses... So don't worry too much about if you win, if you lose. Getting the bonus is great, you know? We all love bonuses. You know, it's, it's not what drives us. Personally, I just think this is extremely relaxing. Now, not all of them we can do this way. And we can't do... Um, just say the automated crafting of the gathering like if you're doing actual gathering you can just hit a box over there and it will just mine the entire thing and that is not the case right now also what i want to do while we actually no i want to finish this leaf first before we queue up for the lord of worm because or the lord of world because we do need to do it. It's a MSQ bit and we cannot progress without doing it. Ah, oh, that's, that's, ah. Uh, that's two in a row, man. I'm kind of hoping we can reach level 30, but 
might might be a bit difficult might be a bit difficult now we don't have the gpu for it. now you have foods that will help also i still did need to do the class quest and we will do that during this particular stream as many as we can do and that will actually increase our chances quite a bit but i also want to get the fishing one for it uh, leveling all three of them up at the same time like some will give you gear and I believe it's always like uh, top, bottom or uh, head. Could also be something else. So if you level all three of the classes up the same time, it's probably easier than doing anything. So we'll definitely pick up the fishing one. But I kind of wanted to get the miner to level 30. Uh, that, that's not happening. We should get a lot more XP. We get level 28 right now. That will help. That will increase uh, our chances by 10%, which is actually quite good. I like that. Oh, it's actually 75. Now, we don't have the, the GP for it. You could just wait. It will go up quite slow. As you can see right now, there is food you can take, which I, of course, I don't have. Increase spirit bound. No, nobody cares about that right now. Yeah, I don't have that right now. We'll wait until we hit 100. There you go. And then we hit sharp vision. 72%. I kind of... Oh, it seems that we might actually reach a additional 5%. That would be great. Yeah, we should actually be able to reach that. Two more spots to go. Don't forget, guys, to use Sneak. Now, at uh, some particular level, uh, there's Auto Sneak. Uh, I think it's in Trade. Oh, actually, we have Auto Sneak on our Miner. This one we don't need anymore. So whenever we switch now, it's Auto Sneak. But before level 27, oh dear, you don't want to forget that. You really don't. Let's just do it without sharp vision. You actually get more GP. Uh, from I think doing mining itself. Especially when it succeeds you get like 5. So the higher your GP is the better. Uh, let's wait for 90. I kind of want to hit the 286. But I don't have the gear. We already know that. So this is the, the final leave on this one that I'll do. Let's get sharp vision in there. Uh, we could also use some of these bounty for harvest and stuff like that. So you get multiple items, which also brings you up. But I, like I said, don't have the gear to actually get a constant out of that. And last one, I think. There we go. Uh, you get five if per successful hit, but you can get cordials from Grand Company that do... Yeah, I, I think it's so expensive, you know. 400 it sounds great but it's it yeah it's actually it is great isn't it i should probably do it. let's collect a reward there we go we get a bonus of thirty thousand because we actually got the additional five percent we get a tiny bit of gear we get adventure points so that should bring us up to 29 not bad at all uh passive regen fire overworld tick one by one also seals true they are, they are free. That's very true. Uh, let us queue up. Not this one. This one. While we go and... You know, let's go to Limsa. And potentially pick up the Fisher one. Oh, okay. That's good to know. Let's take a look how expensive those seals are. Uh, let's go to the off castle. We'll pick up the fish. I think it will take me a while. Uh, let's replace uh, the Imperial Salute. I don't need anymore. I like having them a bit sorted out. So I know that like, this is where uh, gathering and then crafting and then classes... Uh, quartermaster. 
that in here? Uh, no. Material. There's also foods that will help you. Uh, let's take a look. GP. I need GP. Because this is crafting. Uh, yeah, gathering and perception. And this additional XP. 500. Which would be one of the best foods that you can get. Like CP is crafting point, so that's not going to help me. Moonstones you can actually get from the Ixali. If you need Moonstone, do the Ixali quests, uh, the crafting quest, that will help. Already have one of the manuals. This is not what I'm looking for. Where is the thing? Am I really missing it? Am I looking over it? Probably. Chip later. Uh, have a good one. Uh, the corals are right there. You just didn't see them. Yeah, I'm an idiot. There you go. It's 300. 300 GP. Is there a higher level from that corals? So we could get gathering and perception increase. Still, yeah, you know, it, it's better than nothing. True. Five of them. Log behind level 60. Okay, well, that's good to know. Let's get some of that food. This one. And I might need to do my leaf quest then. But I kind of don't want to do that on one of, of my quote-unquote main classes. So we might need to pick up another class. It might just so be that I'm going to be very, very sidetracked today. Very, very sidetracked. Yeah, that's going to happen. Let's get the fisherman. I don't like the fisherman. I've said so many times. But, you know, I like the ocean fishing. It's, it's, it's fast. Um, might be cheaper depending on the server. Oh, okay. We might have to check that out then. Okay, let's go and pick up the fisherman. Uh, well, uh, well, wishing welcome to you, adventure friend. You're, you've worked your way into fisherman's bottom. When you want fish for just a day, you can call a culinarian. But we fishermen feast for life. Oh my god, it's so cringy. I've set the bait. Think you're ready to... Oh my god. Oh, that's disgusting. Hooray, hooray. Looks like we've got a life on. Let me walk you through the life of a fisherman in Limsa Limenza. Since we're surrounded by the sea, the fishing sites are a fisherman's delight. If you, can, if you can't fish it here, you can't fish it anywhere. While some of us rope our fish in with rods and reels... Other skim the seabed with nets for creepy crawler critters. Yeah, we'll also do that at some point. You might say we cast a wide net. People prattle about our pullers just about everywhere in Limsa. And there's much and more I haven't mentioned. We shepherd the ships. Preside over the... We, we, shep, we, we shepherd the ships? Preside over the port, manage the mogler 
and while making sure not to leave any adventurers out to sea. I always prefer to work alone, so we'll start you off with a rod and reel. Now, you might not necessarily net the numbers, net fish yields. Thank you, appreciate that. Um, but, pole fishing positivity pulls pretty prizes. Wait, did it? It didn't happen. Oh shit, now I forgot. Oh, God. oh, I missed the conversation. I hate to hear that you changed the heart, haven't you? No, you give me give me the damn give me the damn thing. Spoken like a true bespoke fishwoman. Well, it's time you met our guild master. But unfortunately, unfortunately, and somewhat ironically, our Nerefius net master is out fishing at the moment. This moment, and every moment that is. So Sisipu tends to tend to tasks that require tending to. Such as deciding whether you'll sink or swim with our guild. Sisipu presiding over those pools, whatever you decide a dedic Wow. Decidedly decide to say hello. She so might be somewhat standoffish, but she'll only keep an eye out for sharks. Be yourself and you have nothing to worry about. This is so bloody cringy. Also, thank you so much for assisting me with the uh, the Lord of World. I was actually... I already had the assumption that this might be a long one. So yeah, here we go. Yes, yes, save your breath. I've heard every word between you and uh, the receptionist. So I know she told you my role here. As she said... Um, Walla Wa Wallago's supposed to be our guild master, but apparently he has bigger fish to fry. So all his work falls to me. That includes making sure our new fish aren't selfish idiots or potential enemy. And the moment yeah, isn't that like a seacom comer? Oh, there we go. Fuck yeah, that's great. Fuck this conversation, it's awful. You've passed the first test, we're not laughing at that awful joke. Now you only need to answer straight away. Prepare your fish like never before. Okay. Uh, are you prepared to fish like never before? Sure. Okay, welcome. And yeah. That is perfect. Awesome. So good. Amazing. Love it. Hate it. Every second of it. Go. Hey, seems like one of the DPSs. Is has fallen asleep. Yeah. Oh, maybe it was me. I don't know. Maybe I, I. I don't know. Let's take a look here. The Lord of World. Uh, wouldn't he just to sing the first ship then? Does that actually do anything for him? Well, guess we'll find out right now. Okay. Yeah, okay, they die. That's it. There's a mighty ship though. It looks great. Oh, I'm expecting to see like massive jaws. Right in my face right now. Come on. Do it. You know you want to. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, that's epic. Go. 
Okay, so need to make sure that we know. Yeah, that's the queue. Okay, um, range go tail, I believe. This one is, uh, there's one of them that shoots like uh, some sort of an oil. Very happy that someone noticed what's going on. Oh yeah. And now we'll lose the railing, I think. See, the, wait, is that it? Wait, that, no way. Wait, that was it? What the f Holy shit! Extreme is the one that drops the rails. Oh, I thought they all did. I, I, oh, wow. Okay, so we've got 365. I think we could potentially get the remainder of our gear. Let's, let's go back to Limsa. We need to go there anyways. Okay, I did not realize it would be that bloody simple. Uh, where the hell is that? Lollafell. There you go. That was so easy. Yeah, there we go. So we get the mask. And that is a entire set finally completed. Equip that. I will not turn it on because I kind of hate the look of it. I think you can actually... Yeah. No bloody way I'll take that on. There you go. Let us do... Something that has no value whatsoever. We're going to be... First of all, we're going to be finishing 2.2 because that is of course one of the goals. And the other one is we are going to do some gathering. Because that is just necessary. When we get the achievement uh, through the maelstrom, we'll uh, we'll start going through uh, through the gathering a bit. I kind of want to make sure that we either get all of them to 30 or 35, so we can start doing some mithril mining. No, in the urge of the business. Okay, just just send me through, please. 
No, no need to give me a very lengthy explanation. Here we go. We Lominsons are sworn to strive till sea swallows all, and swallow all it would have had Leviathan prevailed. That we still strive now, we owe in no small part to you. I love that his voice, though. Not for the first time. You have delivered Limsa Lominsa from the wrath of a primal. Never has our nation known a stouter ally. On behalf of my people, I give you my humblest thanks. Tis meet that I give thanks to old Mistbeard, too, for his fine solution. Whatever else he may have been, Tis clear he was a resourceful soul. Would that I had a man like him in my service. <laughs> I love that. We already know. Like, he already got, like, the mask. Like, he is Mistbit. The one who is Mistbit owns the mask. Uh, so, yeah. He's going to be absolutely overjoyed. <laughs> Before I set foot in these lands... I had no inkling that the people of Eorzea contended with such mighty foes. Suffice it to say, their existence came as something of a shock, as did the idea that they could be defeated. I do, I do actually, I did, I uh, started yesterday uh, with them, with the exception of the fishing one. So once we equip the rod, we'll get a, the daily, I want to do it before four. Uh, if, with you, it's 8 p.m. here. I think with me, it's 4 p.m. when it resets. Yeah, true. But I'm also going to do leaves. Uh, the leaves actually do help quite a bit. This experience has served to remind me of the vastness of the world and the boundless potential of man. Though I am but a refugee in this realm, I would fain be of use to you in your fight. Know that I am tutored in one of the foremost combat arts of the Far East. It may seem outlandish to the Eorzean eye, but should any of your people care to learn, I would be pleased to initiate them. And I will see to it that they are grateful. I have no doubt that your knowledge and skills will serve us well. Okay. So this is how the rogue got, like, introduced, actually, then. Besides, your art is not so outlandish as you think. Would you not agree, Master Thancre? Not escapes your searching eye, Admiral. Few are privy to this information, but Limsa Lominsa is home to a certain secret fraternity. Its members are trained in a form of combat, not unlike your own. By my judgment, it should not be beyond such individuals to adapt to the techniques I witnessed you employing with such admirable deafness. And so cool. I am heartened to hear this. I too noted a kinship between your style and mine own. Though it seemed to me that you fought differently in the beginning. I, I suppose I did. What can I say? I'm a man of many talents. <laughs> Though you may labor to believe it, Thancred was once something of a scoundrel who fraternized with the criminal class in these parts. You stole her! You jest, of course. <laughs> that expression. But for a chance encounter with Alfino's grandsire, he might never have left Limsa Lominsa, or received an education in Charlian, or taken up his post in Uldar, which is where he trained in the Blade, lest you wonder. Minfilia, please! <laughs> it would seem there is more to you than meets the eye, Master Thancred. Lady ah. Nigiri, I am told that you and yours came to Eorzea seeking permanent resettlement, and that many domains have since been engaged as frontier hands at Revenant's toll. Moderna is many things, 
but a place of refuge it is not. If you were watching, then you started doing ninja actions during his pre. Yeah, yeah, of course I was watching that. I was, I was, I was playing it, and he gets like the second knife up and he starts doing uh, cool stuff. That's great. Know that I would like nothing better than to furnish your people with a new home here on Lominson soil. Alas, wracked by instability as we are, our nation is in no fit state to take you in. Yet I'll not have it said that we turned a blind eye to your suffering. Until such time as we can do more, I pledge to send provisions. We are in your debt, Admiral. I realize that it scarce qualifies as repayment. But if it please you, I shall set about sharing my martial knowledge with your people at once. Sure it was 2.4. Like she's actually saying, like she's starting it right now. You wished a word in private. The better not to spoil the festive mood. History repeats itself, Admiral. As the kobolds did before them, the Sahagin resorted to summoning their god over a territorial feud. They acted in self-preservation. It may be that the Sahagin initiated this particular clash, but how it begins does not interest me so much as how it ends. I have not forgotten our conversation, Yashtola. I am aware that man bears part of the blame for the Primal's existence. Nor am I ignorant of the Sahagin's reason for acting. They sought to secure a place to breed and multiply that their kind might survive. Self-preservation, as you say. But we have as much right to live and thrive as they. If our own survival is threatened, are we to lay down our arms and welcome oblivion? Nay. And so you kill, that you might live. Yet if living is a right, then that right belongs to all peoples, be they men or beastmen. I'll not deny your reasoning, but when a storm gathers, it falls to me to see my people safely through it. That is my duty, and I shall do it. As must we all, Admiral. Stay the course then, but know that it will lead to no good end. You know, it makes it, both of the stories makes a lot of sense. Man has ever put himself first and foremost. To justify his actions, he clads himself in the armor of righteousness, though it be a fancy of his own making. In this, mayhap the Galians and we Domans are not so different. Eorzea has become as a raging sea. If we are to keep our heads above the waves, we cannot scruple to drown the man next to us. When hopes of coexistence founder, strength must determine who has the greater right to live. Well, it makes perfect sense to me, to be fair. Okay, so let us make sure this one is finished. So we get a weapon coffer, I level 90, which is, you know, not going to be interesting for us. The Admiral has informed me of the arrangement. I have to keep, I have to, keep, I, I have in my keeping a letter of introduction for uh, Lady Yugri. To the south stands a gate leading to the pier for small fishing vessels. Look for inconspicuous where a man over there. Present the letter to him. Serves the gate. See, it, they really. This is where the, the rogue gets in. 
Now, before you go, I'm obliged to remind you that the member of um, fertility, the fraternity to which you would be introduced, abide in the shadows of limbs in the society. They value, their, they value their independence more highly than pirates and are united by a strong bound, a stronger bound of, are united by a bound stronger than Mithril. To wit, they are in a variable way of new faces. Though it, is, it, though it be penned by the Admiral himself, more words on parchment will get you only so far into their confidence. You must work every ounce of trust in the place to you. Oh, okay, like so. So, in 2.4 you could, like, really start a class. Like, so, in, in 2.3 it's all about the the rogue and the ninja. But here's a letter. Go to the aforementioned place and show it to the aforementioned man. Oh, and good luck. Yeah. Uh, actually, this is where the gatekeeper is. And we need to go there. Fine. Can we just walk there? And navigating through this definitely not my strong strongest point yet. Like from all of the cities, I think Limsa La Minza is most like a maze. You had hundreds of nerds running around you. <laughs> wow, really? Of a minute? Damn. I think I ran the wrong place, but I, I'm not sure. Yeah, I think I need to be down here. There you go. An inscuspicious man. Oh, he's going to be talking like a pirate, isn't he? Hmm, got best with me adventure? Yep, he is. That's going to be annoying. That's not Jack. So you're the woman the Admiral sent word of. Um, Admir actually, there is going to be an ad that I cannot stop anymore. I already snoozed it three times. You can only snooze an ad three times. I was hoping it might ca uh, I might be catching a clip of Tantra too. Been a while since I saw this shite eating grin. My god. But with all that do I wrenches about, I suspect he's got his hand full. Ah, you must be the far easterner that Mayor was taught, uh, uh, wants to train with us. Welcome to Limsa, my lady. I am Ugav Doma. It's an honor to make your acquaintance. I must confess, when first I learned of your organization, I had certainly preconceptions as to the nature of your members. It would seem I was mistaken. We're not the first person to say that last. Limsa, Limsa is a city of pirates, to be sure, and pirates don't give two farts about keeping a spotless reputation. They hardly need a secret society to do their dirty work. Might be as my people and I keep to the shadows, but we've got nothing to be ashamed of. It's simply better for business that we remain unseen. And so you have developed fighting techniques suited for that purpose, I see. Knowing that the practitioners of my art too are descendants of the shadows, it's in stealth that our strength lies. There is much we might learn from, a, from one another, I think. Then what in the seven hells are we waiting for? If you'd come with us, Uguri of do what -ish. <laughs> Oh, you ass. You can get acquainted in more private surroundings. Ah, but that didn't come out right, did it? No, that didn't. It definitely didn't. Lady and I shall remain with these people for a time. Might study their ways. Though I'm loath to be separated from my countrymen, I take solace in the knowledge that they are in the best of hands. They have been, um, you have been a true friend to us domans, no word would suffice to express my gratitude. Erlong, I hope to begin imparting my martial knowledge to the people of Eorzea. When the time comes, it would be my honor to welcome you as a student. I'm already an adept uh, miss, I, I fight with daggers too. 
Like, um, it's fine. Like, Facebook, uh, okay, that's sometimes so weird. Like, there's this, this blink going on, and I'm like, oh, okay, new chat, but then there's nothing going on. Uh, wait, what the, f what the hell is this kind of magic? Any fair level 55 healers looking to mail easy a time burning message me, please? Need to grind max dungeons for level starting. Uh, okay, so he is... What do you want? He looks cool, though. Oh, he needs someone to actually guide him through the dungeons. Easy kill. Can't speak today. Okay, well, that sucks. Hey, through the maelstrom. That actually is... Oh, my God. Look at that face. He's just looking for group. Yeah, and no, I can't help him with that. Instead of using party finder... Oh, okay, like so. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, much and more has occurred since... First, I beheld the Osia from my Galleon's deck. Suffice it to say, I did... Oh, the lights turned on. I'm like, what the fuck's going on? I did not envision... Uh, did not in envisage being invited to play part in your noble struggle. But forgive me, I have kept you over long. Doubtless you have pressing business of your own, yet yeah, like fishing. Rest assured that I do no, uh, that I no longer require an escort to this land. When next time when when next you meet Lady Minfilia, pray relay to her my humblest thanks. Would that I could do so in person, but uh, but I must needs fulfill my purpose to the Admiral. Till we meet again, Warrior Light. Let's put this on social because he's spamming. I don't like it when people start spamming. So let's go to the Rising Stone. Get through the Maelstrom. Get back to Limsa. Get the fishing. Uh, get it to five. And then start doing like some of these class quests to get them out of the way. And it's going to be an extremely, uh, I think, casual stream today. Just, you know, a bit of gathering. Probably, well, maybe. You know what? Let's do it completely different. You could just blackmail them. No more spamming. Yeah. Stop your spamming, boy. I say that. What we also could do is, like I said before, like, I know gathering might not be everyone's interest. So, I could just keep that stuff to myself and do a new game plus to go through the story stuff. Kind of don't like going it, doing it like that, but you know. I have been reflecting upon the events which took place during our visit to Vilbrand. If you have a moment, I would share my conclusions with you. Please, bear with me. I did say gathering, yeah. How are you doing, Comet? When the Sahagin Elder summoned Leviathan, he employed the power we have come to know as the Echo. Gather is live. Okay, we'll do gathering. Fine, if, if everyone's in favor, we'll do it. Though I cannot well explain the how of it. It would seem he became immortal in so doing. When the Admiral subsequently slew him, his spirit emerged from his lifeless flesh, a consciousness shorn of physical form. Thus transfigured, he took up residence in the body of his minion with the ease of a man donning a favorite glove. Long have I known that the Echo allows one to pass through the walls of a man's soul. Man, way to go, man. I loved Heavensward. I really did. Uh, I really felt it was a great story. Hope you did enjoy the, uh, the story. So you'll uh, unlock the diadem then. But never did I imagine that it could free us from our own flesh, nor less that our souls could then occupy the next corporeal vessel to take our fancy. It was of this that Elidibus spoke. An existence which knows neither cessation nor oblivion. And yet, though the Sahagin had mastered his gift and thereby become immortal, he was by no means invulnerable. As we both bore witness, he was ultimately absorbed into Leviathan. And the import of this observation? If the Asian's mode of existence is indeed the same, it can be inferred that they too are not invulnerable, 
that they can be destroyed. There exists a legend which tells of souls who are reborn upon the cusp of each umbral calamity, that they might stay the encroaching darkness. To most, it is but a fairy tale. Yet recent events have given me cause to wonder. Could the legend in fact refer to the Echo? Okay, so you overleveled your Black Mage? Unlocked. I think Sage is healing with damage. Like, the more you... Or I might be confusing it with something else. Or is it with the cards? Is Sage the card one? I, wasn't it the Sage who mainly healed through, like, DPSing? I don't know. No, that's the Astro. Sage is Laser Pew Pew. Ooh. Ooh, I like Laser Pew Pew. Uh, jumping in directly into Sage is the easiest way to have a really bad time. Uh, yeah, because you'll just get absolutely overwhelmed by a number of skills then. Much and more yet remains unknown, but I am confident that all will become clear in time. For the present, however, what matters is that the key to defeating the Asians may at last be within sight. With Orianger's aid, it is my hope that I shall fathom this matter ere long. Oh! I was just about to send for you, my friend. Is Otimus? Grave tidings from the Charlian motherland, my lady. It doth concern our distant allies, the students of Baldessian. What of them? My lady, the Isle of Val, which for many years hath been the Order's home, is no more. No more? Whatever do you mean? It's poofed, it's gone. I relate only that which hath been conveyed unto me by our agents. An etheric wave of the highest magnitude was recorded in the region. Wait, was it? Soon thereafter... Did the Leviathan the wipe out the island then? Ceased to be. No, it's an etheric wave. Tis postulated that a magic was evoked. Like in power to Ultima. Twelve preserve. If there are no other matters, I move that today's meeting be adjourned. Oh, come on, give me that Grim. Oh, he is going to be so evil, isn't he? Yep. It is done, my lord. I... <clears throat> Forgive my impertinence, my lord, but these orders... I am uncertain as to what end they serve. Come on, do it. Revolution. Revolution. Okay, so it's not that overwhelming then. Okay, so this will give me through the maelstrom. That reaches the end of 2.2. We This quest will bring us into 2.3. So... Okay, everyone who's shy to nakedness, you might want to look away. Maybe I should have told, told that before, actually. Fisherman. There you go. Just do it like this. Uh, gear. Way better. We have bait in there. Let's click that on. My first fishing rod. Let's go to Limsa. 
Uh, we'll definitely get the XP and stuff going. <laughs> uh, onward to the fishing guild. Let's see how fast we can actually level this. So we'll um, equip ourselves with the gathering and perception food. So that is only 30 minutes? Oof. Jeez. So you look quite formidable. Let's hope you don't scare all the fish away. Now the first rule of fishing is to hold on to your rod. Take care of your rod and your rod will take care of you. Let me know if I'm going too fast for you. Since you're new here, we're going to start small and they don't come much smaller than anchovies. <laughs> uh, 30 minutes is quite, it's not a lot. Okay, oh well. So, there is a ninja in the water. Oh, that's you. <laughs> oh, that looks so cool. Really cool. Don't drown. You'll find schools of anchovies swimming around outside the Gal Galdian Bay, so you'll catch your mega supper without even walking 10 yards. Anchovies are hardly a most cunning fish in the sea make them the ideal first assignment simply bait a hook with some of those look worms i gave you dip it into water and the fish will practically catch themselves okay deal with that uh, i think this is good as any the high button will highlight let's go here let's press f1 you can actually put on the light but nowadays you have these question marks and stuff above you. Like that. That was a shrimp. My god. It's that game, isn't it? And there is one thing that you can do. You can actually type in chat, like sit, and because you're fishing, it's actually quite fun, because you'll get this fishing, fishing chair, which is quite cool. Really, it only shows if you have effects turned on. Why would you turn effects off? Fishing is completely around here, fun. Yeah, I'll, I will not be doing this too long. The fishing. Like, I'm already happy that we get the additional XP. 3% plus the gathering thing. And then... I think the... Um, some can see. Okay. I think the botanist as well as the mining job are just so much better level. Uh, seizure, if you, uh, size, size, seizure or seizure issue. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that makes actually perfect sense. That's really well taken care of. Also, I'm receiving an XP bonus from my mentor. Completely forgot you were a mentor. Level 6. Man, this is faster than ocean fishing right now. And I like ocean fishing. Uh, speaking of that... Uh, no, it's going to be an hour. I think ocean fishing in an hour. Yeah, that's better. PC can't render battle effect when there's 48 people around you, so they turn... Oh, yeah, that makes perfect sense, actually. Now, we already have some of the gear, so at level 10, we should be able to get ourselves um, some gear that gives us more perception. Oh, 
Uh, yeah, we actually have it. Let's go. Um, quit that. Level 7. Uh, let's take a look what we have. Yeah, way better. Put that on. That's why I want to do... It. That's why I say that. Level all of them up, up at the same time. Because you'll get gear. Like, we'll get a... I think it's a... a sh how do you call this? A shirt? And show this uh, swim of the shores of Limsa Lominsa so you can bring them back. Uh, from anywhere you like. As long as it isn't... It, it is not the fishmongers. Okay. Uh, weird, I guess. They're always... Extreme. They're... Chovy Chovy here. Chovy Chovy. Flare flop. The fresh fishies. You've got... Giddy Guppy. Careful they don't slip out of sight. Who the hell is talking? Oh, that's the guild master, isn't it? Yeah, the guild master. What do, you, what do we owe this pleasure? Our guild master got to be after the guppies. Dividing up the daily dru dru drudgery. Pick out the proper boat table. And so much support and service. And who gets after the guild master? We have books to balance, you know. Books you should be balancing. I did my best to balance the books, but the big old keen keel bent the bow back, bouncing the whole batch of the boat. The game calls it buddy. Okay. Interesting. That's not what. You know that it was just an expression. Can we just handle my fish before you start biggering like a married couple? You go either neither here or there, as long as you keep at the bit. Yeah, the books will balance themselves. Okay, then why are you worried about? Don't let that go to your head. Of course, any beginner can snack some anchovies, but you'll need to experiment with different lures and explore new waters if you want to catch the bigger ones. Fundaments are fine. But the fun is fishing for the new finds. Like my uncle always said, fishing is like philandrin. You'll never know what you'll catch. God, that's so damn crazy. And those well-spoken words of wisdom will leave you to your wiles. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, are they really going to go every able fish pun they can find into this oh they are going to by definition they will to be f yeah yeah i don't remember any no i would not be surprised i got two of them right now all the fish in the sea which i think is you yeah that is the ocean fishing trip I think. News about interesting any self-respected fisher, no matter how seasoned. Well, if then uni, un, uni, une, um, you may just have taken up your rod, but anyone can see you've got a keen eye for a fisherman. And I reckon you are looking for to make a eye keener still. Bigger fish, more exotic location. I, that's what we all seek, ain't it? And. It's just so happened I can tell you how to find them. You see, the Fisherman's Guild uh, has just finished construction of a vast boat. Good for voyages into high sea. Far as I know, the captain is looking for a band of fishermen adventurous enough to brave the deepest fish holes. Uh, of fish hole of them all. If you think you've got the stones for it, I'm sure... Wait, you saying that to me, mate? I'm sure you'll be glad to take you on. So that is indeed the ocean trips. You took up your rod. Is, is this helping me at all? Let's take a look. Craft. Oh, crafting and gathering. Gathering 17. Gathering 13. Don't need that. Uh, I don't have a rod in there. But let's go here. Bigger fish to fry will get a new rod. And we get 
some more items. Might pick up these gloves though. They're actually the same, never mind. Okay, so this one's definitely better. Look. Gathering 8, perception 4. That's what we will need to do. We need perception and gathering as high as possible. The higher it is, the easier we'll get fish. We also get a lifetime supplies of Krish fish balls. Hmm. I smell you haven't been neg neglecting your duties. I have been. A commendable attitude. No one ever gotten worse at anything by practicing. No one I know, at least. Then again, I can't expect the same old tricks to work with new fish. Bigger ones don't grow to be their way chasing everything that wiggles on a hook. To catch the fish you want, you must first know what the fish wants. Only once their prize is at stake, you can naturalize and tempt your prey to taste the forbidden tackle. Anchovies may be willing to settle for lugworms, but harbor her herring have a descending palate that prefers pill bugs. But don't take my word for it. Go and see for yourself. Pick up some pill bugs from someone who is at the Western Isle. We actually need to go there and use them to catch three local harboring herring. Like anchovies, they can be caught right outside. Read this because they will actually tell you where to go. So we need pill books, and in case you have a mind returned to your previous spot, you should know that fish aren't as full as, as they might think. Keep casting your line at the same waters and you'll find that few... I don't think it works like that in this game. I've never had a fishing spot run out. Then again... Who am I to say that it is, it's like that? Let's go to Hawk Alley. Let's get some of these book, book bills from him over here. It does? Really? How long do you have to like... Uh, let's go 20. That's probably more, more than enough. If you spend like an hour... If you spend an hour in one location, it will just run out. And only fishing spots have the same loot pool. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. So let's take a look when the next trip would be out. I like it. I really do think the fishing is on the ocean is quite good. So here's the captain looking like a boss. Another daring soul come to join our crew, eh? Then let me be the first to welcome you to the Endeavor. He looks cool though. Now, that ain't your regular fishing boat. We sail it here. We sail it where we please. Holding only the course the wind provides to us. Aye. That's the only way. That's the only way that we can see the unseen. Know the unknown. Look at that face. Captain, if I may. The Endeavour is the guild's only ship of this magnitude. And if we are, as you say, sail only where the wind please to take us, we may not ever return to this port. The guild may not look favorably upon such liberal use of its property. <laughs> he is a pirate, all right. Yeah, the face, man. Hey, fallen star. What the f what the hell was that? Everyone, make a wish. Ah, my apologies for for foregoing an introduction. I am Dryskota, sent from the Fisherman's Guild to oversee this venture. Why I'm here when the ship already has a captain? You ask. Well, the captain needs to be overlooked. Well, as you may already know, members of our trade. Uh, the master Wagalo, 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 and the captain included seem to have difficulties managing time. 
I suppose the concept becomes somewhat of a afterthought when one becomes so focused on the water surface. Regardless, I'm here to ensure the ship adheres to its schedule, both by managing its finances and ensuring new crew members board smoothly. The Endeavour will uh, shall embark upon any number of predetermined routes, each of which have a port as their final destination. Rest assured, if you fail to join one voyage, the ship shall return before long. The route we travel will be determined by departure time. And you may speak with me if you wish to know the route before, bo uh, before boarding. Pray bear in mind that we must keep to a strict schedule. We cannot take more crew members after we have begun boarding. And there is no exceptions to this rule, even for captains. So every two hours, there's a ship that will go out for, I think, like 20 minutes. And it is definitely worth to do it. I, I, I hear you. When we board the ship, it's when we get to the exciting part. Fishing. Here. Take these uh, lures. They're certain to attract something worth displaying on your wall. Or, the very least, worth eating. And speaking of that, usually... The, 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 the fish you can buy from the shop, just sell them. And the others you might want to check out, like the marketplace. See if there is uh, some good and decent fish to get. Should be enough for at least... For, for Should be enough to last for one voyage at least. If you're looking for other kinds of bait, you can buy it over there on the docks or on the ship. Try to switch it up now and then. Because if you only see the same bait, you're going to be keep catching the same fish. And that ain't why we do this, is it? You know, it's about points. And one last thing. While Drytola uh, here may be in charge of the practicalers on, on land when we're on the ship it's my word you heat you'll heat so when i say we're fishing here and we're sailing there i won't hear no objections as long as we're clear on that i believe there will be a bounteous fishing for all and with that the endeavor is yours to board if you wish to enter the ship or if you would like a more detailed explanation of what we do, you can only need to ask. No, let's not. Let's, uh, let's accept that. Let's take a quick look. On ocean fishing unlocked. There we go. See, every so it's a 50 minute interval occurring every two hours. Uh, we'll only depart if the crew of... Tw Really? Oh, you will depart early. Yeah, there we go. So every two hours, if you don't have enough people, it will sail after two. You can just ask her and say, uh, we'll start again in an hour. So in an hour, we can go and board the ship. Now, while we're here, we might as well just go and do a bit of that fishing, I think. Let us get the pill bug. Let's go... Sit. Oh, sorry. Do this first, then do that. We need to be here in style, don't we? Oh, we got a double exclamation. Oh, how exciting. That was actually quite fast. It's a large one as well. Fist size, we got sneak. Once again, our... Class is not level 27. So yeah, it's definitely needed. Another double one. Hey, this is going faster than I thought it would be. Coral butterfly. Ain't that lovely. Now, I might want to be queuing up... Maybe a class that we can, you know, keep dungeons going as well. But, you know, might as well do that next week. I want to get to the end of the class, like level 50. So I can actually assist my free company more. Because some of these guys have been gathering, crafting, 
going through the workshop, doing everything they need to do. Okay, another one. One more to go. Level 9. 9 minutes on the food. I do need the seals. I don't want to do the faiths. Hmm. So we might need to queue up a dungeon. And the higher level, the better. There we go. Gold fishing, that's up. We leveled up. We are now level 10. Nothing new. Great. Uh, let's go to the Fisherman Guild. Because this is the level 5 mission. And we're clearly going to be getting the next one right away. Uh, sometimes if you have the money, you know, you don't want to fish because you are overleveled. You, uh, you just want to, you know, buy the fish of the market. It will work. It sure as hell does. Bring me free harboring Harry and this test, uh, both kill. Okay, we already know this. Why did they repeat this? Your ability to count. Oh my god. There's nothing better than a salted harbor herring. Save, uh, save for perhaps fried harbor herring or grilled or... No, definitely salted. You know, in the yeaster years of my youth, I used, I used to use every fish I yanked out to yield a bigger one. A good gamble until the game got gargantuan. I guess I got greedy. When did you... Well, sometimes it's best to throw back the big ones. Good God. What's the guildmaster got to do with... Uh, got to do garden and grain for attitude. Acting respectable would be a start. Respectable? I sail the seas and snort everything that swam in there. And that would be an accomplishment. If by everything that swam in there you meant fish. And not... Lady Divers. Wait, what? He fished up Lady Divers? And you got break and all you ever brought back were stories about cautious with trollops. The hell is he doing, man? Cavern is just a red herring. The harbor herring, that's what important name me the lesson of thinking from that perspective of the fish when selecting bait. I don't like this quest line at all already. In that regard, I can say you truly have a mind of fish. So here's a treat. Believe in the fish. Be the fish. Feel the fish. Don't feel the fish. It's disgusting. Uh, some of it might seem like gibberish at first. But as you make observations and jot down notes, eventually all of it will be gibberish. Well, take some time to study up. But be careful not to fry your fish brains. You'll be needing it for your next lesson. My god, could you be any cringier than that? My connection was lost. Okay, am I still on? Seem like I'm still alive. No, uh... No, actually it is still alive. What the hell? We see ya. Oh, thank you. Did everyone just get disconnected? Like, did you get disconnected? Don't... Oh, my God. I have to do the entire thing again, don't we? Let's click through it, then.
Okay, let's see him doing the do stupid dance. Why is she fucking? Why is she crying? Oh, there we go. Uh, we got that one as well. Am I not standing on the floor? So here's a treat. Some of it might seem like okay, gibberish. We all got that. Fish brain. <laughs> um, let's take a quick look. Item comparison. That's the same, but this pens is better. Let's take it. Uh, we can use it as well on my fisher, on my botanist, on everything. The one thing that we need to be taking care of is that we actually do have those equipped. So we're gathering 73. Food is about to run out in a few minutes. The princes and the fish. We get some bloodworms, amateur fishing rod, and... Item comparison. We'll get a straw hat. Or. Shoes. I like shoes. Kind of like wearing them. Ooh. What's that in your eye, Une? I know that glimmer. It is Eye of the Fisher. It is the trail of the bite. Rising up to the challenge of our... Oh my fucking god. Guys, seriously. Oh, every stupid pun. Keep that spark alive, friend. Don't want you to end up like uh, the Guildmaster. Not that I'm worried about you. Oh, yes, I can see it. There is fire inside of you. Burning for fish. More fish. Bigger fish. It is time to feed that fire. Today is the day. Today you catch your first big one. I already booked Bill got a kick one. Makes you wonder when Lullafells are finally accepted as fish bait. I hope soon, especially with ocean fishing, you know. We've been trying casting big fish out. We might as well try casting out a lolofil. Journey foot to the banks uh, in the midst of Lanusia. There you will find her, the Princess Trout. Take the princess and return here triumphant. Her Royal Highness uh, is drawn to clay fish bowls. Clay fish bowls. It is. Do I have them? Yeah, I do. And we needed to go to... Middle, right? I need to check that first. Oh yeah, middle. There's another thing that we need to do, actually, and that's in your list in the timers, uh, which you can just, I think, like if you press P, uh, main command, um, there you go, duty timers. You'll get this list. It helps you with your estate stuff as well, like voyages, construction on the way. Like, this is why I'm going to be doing the gathering. I want to help these guys. Getting my stuff ready. And... Clay fish. Crayfish. Have not got any of them. So, who knows. Let's get on to my chocobo. Now, this area doesn't have hostile monsters yet. But just make sure you get used to... Putting sneak on if you're under level 27. Uh, I don't know if I can find it over here though. Let's let's take a look. Um, this chum will um, actually make it so you can you actually catch fish faster. That's, that's, that's bloody fast. Where do I find the crayfish? The clayfish? Also. I 
think it should be in this place as well. And this will only last one turn. Another one. Where do I find a crayfish? I think it might just be in Limsa. Wolf. Okay, let's let let's look that up. Um, Final Fantasy crayfish. Whatever it's called, crayfish. Limsa upper decks. He actually is being sold by someone on the Limsa upper deck. Uh, we need fish cray balls, and where do we get them? Um... We just buy him. I would just buy the crayfish for like six gil. Yeah, let's go there. Why not? Might as well help me self out a bit. <laughs> oh god, no. I'll do the ocean fishing and I will most likely end up buying the fish from the market. I'll be absolutely honest about that. I eventually have myself a bit of a task. And I think that is... Yeah, this is the guy. Let's go to the other castle. I do want to finish the entire fishing log. Which is something that I might not ever be able to do. There you go. Wait, what, 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 what? At level 70 when catching a vegetarian? <laughs> so we'll have to keep an eye. So in 45 minutes... Yeah, that was hardly worth it. I am aware of that. Now, eventually, the seals you'll get will be better. Um, the description is Fisher Legend that there was once a mighty... I don't know how to pronounce that. Who, unsatisfied with the diet of the Nazareth, set have set up the silent plump and prey, namely poor, a portly Lullafell regent with some skin dipping in the warm waters and hell's lit. However, the fish quickly learned the limits of its small gape and crestfallen abandoned the king a crown shaped scarf on his lip only its only prize rather than scar the beast tips and the rest character limits yeah I'm sorry for that I'm, there's nothing I can do with that it, it's twitch this ain't X it's the new name of, tw of twitter right X Stupid. Alright, let's uh, let's go to the fisherman guild. Also, yeah, okay, nothing new. Yeah, it, it it really just really pushes that one forward, isn't it? Rather than send the beast and deeply devouring the creature of light. <laughs> oh yeah Lollafels are fish is fish food is cannon holy shit 
<laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's the best. That is the best. Ah, uh, if you find... Okay, well, we already do. That's amazing, man. Uh, depending on your perspective, you either rescued or abducted the princess. A prime and proper princess he is. We're ready. Uh, we'll really... We re... re ready her as a royal roast. <laughs> a feast fit for a king. Oh, God, these cheap... These puns. These puns, man. The king can keep his fancy feast. The fisherman's word, the salt prefers a trout, perhaps, simply. Is that like a surely salted mouthed sea hag? Hender over here and heed how the culture's class who. A fine day it will be when I take culture lessons from you. Besides, I didn't send Una out to that river to fetch a fish for you. I sent her out to fetch a fish for me. Sophisticated translation there. Trolls <laughs> That is, that is, oh wow. Yeah, they did nothing there through. So if you translate the, the Uldian god, Null to Troll, you get Troll's bloody balls. <laughs> okay. Then Japanese and figured out to translate it back. It started in English, then Japanese, then... Okay. Um, for my lesson it is, yes, of course. What's the purpose of all the explanation? Okay. Anyways, you should have learned catching a proper fish requires preservance. Plain and simple. As this... Plum Princess Trout can testify to that. Continue to apply your lessons I've taught you, and before you know, you'll be swimming in fish. Doesn't that sound appetizing? Not really. Um, let's get the hood. I I'm kind kind of done with the fishing for now. It's definitely not something I like doing. But, you know, it has its uses. There you go, a hat. As well as a rot. Now. Anything else? No? Okay. Botanist. There you go. New stuff. Update. Miner. Update. My first pickaxe. Or my thing. Now, actually... I kind of just want to continue with... The MSQ. I don't want to fish the entire entire stream. Now uh, that that's too much for me. We'll do the ocean fishing, so we have a bit of fishing going on today, and then next time we'll do a bit of botany and a bit of the mining. It's already at forty-five, fifty-two. 55. Yeah, I think it's time that we do a bit of white mage stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, we actually do need to do the alliance raid. Oh, yeah, it's definitely. You, you're right. Labyrinth of the Ancient. Let's queue that up. Go back to this. Because we have the gear. Wait, why is my ninja not at full? There you go, 130. It's white mage gear stuff. Yeah, true. It's, f it's three of them, right? Go to Minfilia. And we start officially... Ooh, the 110 is actually quite nice. Yeah, we'll just go for the money. 
You know, 110 is not interesting, actually. Okay, our friend, uh, our friends, the very isle itself, everyone and everything. No, no, it avails me not to speculate. Uranger will send word if there are any developments. Until such time as he does, we must remain firmly focused on that which is within our power to change. That, uh, with that in mind, I would speak of a different matter, one closer to home. I think it's a dungeon, right? This this particular one. It concerns the ephoretic fluctuations which we had previously attributed to good King Mughal Mark XII. That the king is no more is a blessing for which we have you to thank. Yet all is not well in the twelfth route. Our latest readings reveal an ongoing ephoretic disturbance of considerable magnitude. They have ever been suggest the presence of a primal. Needless to say, the more the mere possibility warrants imminent investigation and i would have you good king mughal mod yeah i did say that right it's good king mughal mog mog it's, it's so annoying um acelia i do not wish to interrupt but we have a problem what matter of problem a band of refugees hailing from Uldar this time are coming to Reverend Stoll seeking asylum. It would seem they expect us to afford them the same treatment we gave the Domans. At present, they are in the Seven Heavens, uh, awaiting a formal response. I see. Mayhap this was to be expected. I shall meet with them at once. Asilia, you know full well we haven't the resource to accommodate many more people. Consider what will happen if you do this. Word will spread and more will follow. Your opinion is duly noted, but I will hear their suit. Uh, Nadia. Uh... Could I just invite you to the... Um the, the link shell, the crossworld link shell, or the link shell. You can do that as well. You should be grateful for your presence at this meeting. Why? Why do I need to be there? You're, you're the boss. Uh... I need to add. Sure. I'll, I'll go as a priest. That's fine. No, it's fine. I'll do, I'll do priest. Ready, check. Just, 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 just go. Just do it. Um, can I... There you go. It's already crossworld member. Wait, what? Ha! What? Okay, fine. Uh, I need to add more people to this. It's just so much easier. Una, you're healing. Yeah, I'll, I'll heal. I'll do my best. Oh, you just... Oh, like so. Yeah, 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 yeah. Makes sense. Thank you. Appreciate that. Well, already? I'll expect that. Did I have all of my class skills on this? Medica 2, Cure, Benediction, Regen, Holy is there, Benedict. I don't... I can't use this. There's no point in doing... I don't get lilies. Because I'm level... F you know, not in... Again? Presence of mind. Yeah, should be fine. Yeah, that is fast. I did, could we maybe do some of the harder dungeons as well? Oh, I'm stuck in this region now, huh? Yeah, you're saying 250 anyways. That's right. Okay, 
Cinematic time. No, no, no extremes. No, 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 no. I don't want to do extremes right now. They're too much. Uh, I want to practice them first because I want to go and do them once. <sighs> and not like 15 times again like last time where we did like Ifrit and we did the Naval and we took three hours. Three bloody hours doing them. What's up, nerds? <laughs> Hi. Uh, we are group C. And Nadia is our tank. Okay. I have no clue where we are going. That should be fine, right? Also, the gear that we get, if we don't want to use it, we just exchange it. Group C for something. Why am I so slow? Path of Decay. Ew. I kind of want to get Materia up and run in. Why is he standing outside? Damn it. Oh, I'm going to be dead. Okay, I need to be on here. Okay, thank you. Is there a reason I need to be like on that? Oh, yeah, I see. Do some regen. There you go. Where's Nadia? Over there. Okay, let's go. Just follow the crowd. Do the obvious. Take in and take instruction. And it sounds very easy, actually. I like that. Incoming ad break. Sprint. I was on cooldown, I think. Healing a healer. Always fun. So stay on these platforms, I guess. Simple. Just stay behind our tank here. So I'm going to assume first boss. Wow, the bone dragon is going down like crazy. Damn. Okay. Uh, what the hell? He is being raised. Can't really get away from this due to the poison and stuff. Okay, let's go. Cure. My okay, poison is gone. Let's get here. Oh, 
that. Oh, he's back again? How many times is he going to be, like, summoned? Oh, rotting eyes. Yep, they're going to be annoying. Yeah, we get some 10 tombstones and we got some loot. I will greet or need anything I come across. That's one thing. Uh, where the hell do we go? Oh, never mind. I got it. Just forgot to have that supper. What? I like it when they actually tell people what to do in these um, situations because, like, I don't have a clue. Wow, I got a 90 on that roll. Forgot to suck. Wait, what? I have no clue what they're on about. That's fine. I'm not going to pay attention to it. Uh, we are at group C. Let's go. I think it has something to do with that platform or something. What's this? There you go. That's weird. Two, three, four. Where the fuck? Where's... Come on, dude. Hurry the hell up. Uh, ignore the ads if not on the pad. Bring ads back to pad. People, please. See down too. Well, whatever. Let's go. We just stand over here, I guess. I, I can't do anything. can't really reach it. Oh, you just have to fetch it. Interesting. It's no longer shining the pad, so I'm going to assume that it is fine. And we are definitely not in the best of positions, I guess. Yeah, that's easy. So we're lacking our a DPS. Who was clearly at the wrong path. What, what's up with that? That's weird. I don't know what the hell is going on. But I'm going to assume that magic pot is going to be annoying. Seems like they're being like, get it. Okay, it's the sand creatures need to go. Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't think that's good. There you go. Done. I think it was the sand creatures, right? Need that. Greet that. I will need and greet everything that's for my class. I, I don't really care about that. Like, I don't have the gear anyway, so... Let's take a look. White Mage, Skull Sage, try them on. We always have to be butt naked. Cool, we got it. And we got the Ballot Crown as well. I need seals. <laughs> Holy... Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait. One, two, three, four, five bosses? What? Really? Thank the 12 for the auto run button. Yeah, I agree. Uh, no, no need to cast the cure. I'm going to assume we take care of one of these. Okay, uh, um, um, let me do material. Why is he standing? Now uh, everyone's there. We can go. Uh, five, four, three, two. Wow, turn the birds are go. Oh, he was actually doing a, a countdown. Oh. I did not realize that was going bomb. Okay. Okay, 37. Don't die yet. Don't have time for it. Okay, let's go. Yeah, we're just lacking a tiny bit on DPS. We get rid of that poison on you. That was fast. Um, hey, Une Green Mages for the win. Oh, yes. Uh, okay. You're surprised it's only one. You're surprised it's only one who wasn't with the party? Okay, what's up with these towers? No, just too late. Oh, that is just annoying. Uh, let's rest. Oh, I don't. Whoa. This is going so fast. Like, I know I don't have the gear for it, but still. Come on, man.
this the boss or is this like the next what the hell he looks very golden Everyone's already gone. I'm late to the party. Yes. Uh, oh, that's not nice. Well, what do we? What do we do? Let's take a look. Pull him away from the center. When he runs back to the center, everyone stands on their respectable button. Don't greet if over 12%. What? Okay. Yes. Okay. Go. Oh, he's dying. Nice, dude. Way to go. Someone listened. Touch my other healer. Oh, that was fast. You call that a labyrinth? Okay. I have no clue what's going on. <laughs> None whatsoever. I still hate that pose quite a bit. I don't know why I picked that. All right, let's complete it. Nice. So uh, we'll get another one, right? We got 40 player recommendations. Let's go with... Not him, because he didn't listen. Uh, great. 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 Neat. Neat. Uh, pass. Pass. I don't care about those. I will wait. It was much harder, but the potencies came up. So you nuke everything. You nuke what? You nuke what? I don't get it. that my gear is better than that right uh. yeah I'm using level 9 this is eye level so this is either just going to be you sell it for seals or you use it as glam can we just get some gear on play oh that is min oh I like that Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, we'll have to use these as glam. And when we actually have all of the items, we'll just deliver them as seals. I think that would be... Nuke mean kill everything from fast, like... Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm quite clear on what a nuke does. Let's take a look here. Oh, you know, nah. Very impressive, I must say. Your name shall be written large in the volumes that are sure to be penned on this historic expedition. He's doubting it. The scale of the structure defies comprehension. Someone plainly thought bigger was better. 
According to the findings of my Baldestian of my Baldestian colleagues who are now deceased, the crystal tower was constructed to collect and store the endless energies of the sun. A characteristically ambitious undertaking. Now, what of the tower's inner defenses? Judging by your hardened expressions, clearing out the labyrinth was no small feat. Actually, I did I didn't think it was that difficult because everyone was good. A giant of a man wielding a shimmering scimitar, you say? Yes. That will have been Plegeton, not Arch Archron Pelotron. He was a hero of the Allegan Revolution. If you gleaned that from what exactly? And you gleaned that from what exactly? His choice of weapons? No, the golden skin. Well, I'm an historian. And I have a certain, shall we say, affinity for the law of the Allegan Empire. Oh, you smock. It is, of course, all knowledge gleaned from mostly scrolls and tomes. The ancient texts claim that the Crystal Tower is defended by the champions of Eld, resurrected and augmented through the elegant extraordinary technology. Chief, you need to see this. Why am I looking up, by the way? Okay. Well, well, there it is. The foot of the tower. What suppose uh, what surprises do you have in store for us, I wonder? I can't tell you how glad I I am to have you with us on this little jaunt. Old friend, uh, old friend, uh, had you not beaten a path through that maze, I very much doubt we'd be standing here now. Well, we have much to discuss and uh, digest. Let us retire to the Saints Quintons. Find for the find for the present and there plan our next step. Lest there be any doubt, our expedition has some way to go to go yet. Okay, just, just let's go. I want to go there's there's I think there's three three raids in this maybe four probably three go there ready check when you're unlocked oh okay yeah i'll ready check when uh, when i get there yeah good good idea What's going on with that? Labyrinth of the Ancient and... Okay, we'll do the Labyrinth of the Ancient completely, of course. I, oh wow, I got a lot of this. Make sure we get that going. Might be more. Oh, there we go. talk to him chief flame sergeant okay. so good of you to join us in our meeting would be dull indeed without a full account of your experience in the labyrinth take a moment to collect yourself and when you are ready we shall debate how best to proceed uh, for prosperity 
Yeah, I don't care about this. I'll just go. I'll get the money. Okay, I'm greedy. Can't help myself. The fellowship of Noah been accounted for. It is time this assembly was called to order. Rambrose will be presiding over the meeting. If you would be so kind as to inform him of your readiness to proceed. Welcome back, Hune. I have just been reading about your encounter in the Labyrinth of Ancients. It pleases me greatly to know that you seem none the worse for the experience. For your reference, I have added my own notes to Garan's preliminary expedition report and begun compiling a Crystal Tower survey log. The information contained therein will be available to you at all times. Should you have any questions, you need only ask. Now, if there are no objections, I shall begin with a summary of the expedition's key accomplishments. Money. In the course of this, our first foray into the grounds of the Crystal Towers, we succeeded in neutralizing the structure's outer defenses before proceeding to secure the maze surrounding the base to the spire. According to Una's account, the labyrinth defenses were most emphatically active. Disturbingly, her report also mentions a violent encounter with a sentry heavily augmented by elegant technology. In short, our misgivings were well founded. The Crystal Tower was not simply trussed above ground by the chaotic shifting of Earth. It was somehow being reawoken. If, as seems increasingly likely, the Tower secret should provide too dangerous to share with the world. We have no other choice but containing them. Short of leveling the place, short of leveling the place, we will almost certainly involve it. it will, this will almost certainly involve returning its mechani uh, mechanisms to its state of dormantry. Dormancy. To do that, however, we will first need to address the question of how they work. The answer to which must surely be awaiting for us inside the tower itself. In conclusion, that is where we must go. A task rather easily said than done. If the perils of the labyrinth are any indication, then I move that all further expeditions of the tower be delayed until such time as an ex exhaustive analysis of the structure's defenses have been completed. Master Garland, may I entrust this task to you? Could, do I have to wait until they're done? It would be my pleasure. We just, you know, oh, don't forget about us. It's like you said, Chief. We founded the ironworks to make sure that technology was used for the right reasons, and that means making sure it's not used for the wrong ones. We wouldn't be doing our jobs if we didn't see this through to the end. You have returned with pizza! It's actually a very, a very good idea. Very good idea. Lads, well, I hope you're ready for some backbreaking chores. How could one be ready? For backbreaking chores. Well, everything seems to be in hand here, so I shall take my leave for you, uh, f of you, for the present. If I am to witness this valiant tale unfold with my own eyes, I must needs hone my martial skills ere we ascend the spire. Nothing like pizza. In the m yeah, for you it's morning. For me it's like almost 4 p.m. I'm getting hungry. We'll do nothing of the shorts. You'll do nothing of the shorts, Gara. Your knowledge may prove useful to Master Gollum's investigation. What the fuck's with that face? I mean, it's, uh, I am not, strictly speaking, subject to your authority. I've been up for 12 hours. I'll be up by, for 20 hours by the time this day is done for me. But yeah, man, yeah, definitely. You have all the excuses to eat pizza in the morning. <laughs> morning. Yeah. Pray not mistake my intent, Dune. I am well aware that I shall never be a match for one with your innant talent. However, hard I train, be that as it may. Pray do not allow your skill to rust. 
from this use during the coming pulse. We will need you your fighting fit if our subsequently for a uh, forays are to prove as productive as this one. Mark me. We have not yet caught more than the briefest glimpse of that which time has obscured. Soon, however, we shall cast off the veil and gaze upon the glory of the Allegan Empire. Not blaming, definitely not. I... Wait, what? Apparently, the US realized pizza might not be the healthiest of food? Wait, it's not? It could have everything. It could have vegetables, meats, bread. Vegetables, grease, calories, fat. Never mind. Yeah. And with the enc encouraging thought in mind, it is time to bring this assembly to a close. Let us all focus on the task at hand, that our next expedition may begin all the sooner. Meeting adjourned. I don't understand why we have the meeting. School pizza. Oh. Oh, nice. Oh, I love that guy. He's so happy. Everything was blown up. Such a terrible mess. Yet it does leave the door wide open, so to speak. One cannot help but be impressed. I'm beginning to understand the reliance you place on adventurers, old friend. So, this is the legacy of the Allegan Empire left behind. If my readings are correct, the energy source waiting atop the tower is a match for even the ultimate weapon. Nay, more than a match. <laughs> a new toy for me to play with. No way! No way! <laughs> we did not know that! I believe the faves uh, had conspired to deny me just reward once again, but it would seem they had a greater desire to uh, in mind for me. He's back! Dun, dun, dun. As long as my ambition burns, I shall strive to seize it. The dream lives on, Sid. Do not disappoint me. He is such a glorious smile, doesn't he? Okay, Cyrus Tower. Serious tower. Who the hell are these two? It's going to be a massive story and then followed by a raid, isn't it? Again. Ah, it is you, my friend. You are doubtless eager to hear of our progress in the Crystal Tower. Well, there's none. Excellent. I'd be disappointed to hear otherwise, of course. Disappointed is the word of the day, I fear. I'm ashamed to say there is nothing worthwhile to report. The suns continue to probe the labyrinth of the ancient, and every day brings new discoveries. Alas, the same cannot be said for the Crystal Tower proper. We've not been able to set so much as a single foot inside. You will recall how the eight sentinels stood between us and the Liberans initially? In like manner, the entryway into the principal spire, Syracus Cyri Cyri Tower, the Elegion call it, is also protected by technology far more advanced than our own. Sid and I have tried every trick we know, but without success. Frankly speaking, we are at a loss. It is discouraging, but we cannot give up. We, uh, de uh, there must be a way in. Ah, and so the situation stands, my friend. Until we gain entry into the tower, I fear your talents shall avail us. 
it will require time that I am low to waste, but I have a mind to set my people to scourge, scour to scourging such ancient text as we have on hand. Perhaps we can be of assistance. And you are? Who the hell are these guys? Be at ease, friends. We share the self same goal. I am Umai, and this is my uh, and my companion is called Doga. We are scholars from the elegant civ wait of the elegant civilization sent by the students of a bastion to desist to assist in your endeavor. Unai and Doga, rather unusual names for this day and age. If I might be forgiving to observe uh, of for observing but i did digress you claim to be here a student's behest but we have received nary a word of your coming moreover in light of recent indica uh, incident at the isle of vowel oh i should think that they have rather a press oh wait 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 yeah says rumbrus thank you so is every patch like 2.2 opens the first, 2.3 opens the second, and 2.4 opens the fourth? Is that how it goes? Because they're clearly talking about the incident at the Isle of Val, which we don't know anything about. Uh, prior version 2.2 or 2.3. Somewhat. Are they just YOLOing it? That's fine. We can only assume that the message failed to reach you due to some mishap. I assure you we are here to help. Especially those red eyes. What is he doing? It's like 0, 0.0 opens rate. Alright. What's it, Gron? Um, it's nothing. There was a pain, but it subsided. Yeah, it's them. The vampires. They have to be. Well, well, that's rather unexpected. Your right eye is the same as ours. Well, my, my. The same? You you have the elegant eye as well? Yeah, you got two of them. You can't see that, right? This Shen Gu's Hu is said to be a trait unique to the elegant. Yet I inherited it from my father as he did from his. Only one child in a single generation is born with the eye. All my life I have s sought to learn the truth of this manifestation. If there's aught you know, I implore you to tell me. My deepest apologies, we have no answers for you. Only one thing is certain, those who possess the trait are bound by faith to Elegant. As your eye has placed you upon the path you walk, so too have we come here to fulfill our destiny. Absurd though it may sound, it is the truth. Uh, point one plus the raids, catch up the upgrade to free the next year on the raids. Oh, okay, I see. So I can do one more raid after this then, because we just started in 2.3. Yeah, it's even. Okay, I guess. You should just get him done. Like their own story, they usually don't spoil anything. Well, with the exception of the incident on the Isle of Val, which we would not have known about if we didn't, like, play the. MSQ up to a certain point. If they are MSQ locked, they spoil. Okay. So it seemed to me we have all to lose in accepting their aid. What do you say? Well, we don't have really have another choice now, do you? If that's what you wish, then so be it. Yet, no, I'm still mean to verify your story with the students of a pedestrian when I'm able. I trust there will be no objections. They have cool gear, though. Very well. As of this moment, 
I name Unai and Dogma advisory members of NOAA. Without further ado, let us have them examine the Sarkus Cy Tower entrance. I promise you won't have cause to regret your decision. Una, you should be much obliged if you would accompany our new friends to the tower. Biggest and Wedge are presently surveying the eight sentinels. The two of them can show you the way. Upon arriving, pray report to Master Garland. He will brief you on the situation. It, what can he brief me about? I shall join you, Una. With Unai and Dogma's knowledge, along with your uncanny knack for setting events in motion, I am hopeful that we will finally see progress. Okay. A lot of talking though. Absolutely a lot of talking. Oh, this is the snow devil. He was actually there, wasn't he? Yeah, he's doing this dude, he's doing the same thing. Where the hell do I get there? Like so, okay, never mind. Wait, what? You got to be kidding me. Bigs. Well, if it isn't Une, you get to uh, enter Cyrus Tower and kill everything inside, no doubt. As I'm sure you've already heard, though, the place is locked up tight as a clam. New friends from the st uh, from the students, you say? Excellent. It's been slow going, or rather, not going f for the chief. He'll appreciate the help. If you just follow me, I'll take it to him. Hey, but it, it, it's somewhat, somewhat like a semi-spoiler, isn't it? Ah, some old faces to lift the spirit. Old face? Oh, and a couple of new ones beside him. Allow me to introduce Unai and Do uh, Dogma. Doga. Doga. They are scholars of ancient Alag. Sent here by our friends of Baldassian. To aid in the investigation. I don't trust you. Like, what's up with your crown? We are you have uh, trouble circumventing the tower's defenses. It is our hope that we can be of some small assistance. They said... Um, uh, um, they mentioned an incident on the island of Val. So they kind of give you a way that there is going to be an incident in the island of Val. Now you don't know what the island of Val is, but if, the, if you want you find out they haven't reached communications with the students of Baldastian, I think you can actually make that link. So I think it's like a eh, tiny, tiny bit of a spoiler. Okay. If your attire is all to go by, your assistance should prove invaluable indeed. True. To begin with, let me tell you where we stand. Beyond rises Circus Tower, the principal spire of the structure collectively known as the Crystal Tower. The only way is to get it. The only way to get inside is through 
the prevail pro proverbial front door the imposing gate you see here the problem is we can't get it open it's sealed by some mechanism whose working are an other mystery to us having had no success via more orthodox methods I went at it with everything from a pickaxe to magenta cannons nothing so much as put a scratch on it for a blessing the gate doesn't try to reduce us to ashes like the eight sentinels but that doesn't make it any less effective a security measure it's fiendishly frustrating in its simplicity the only clue that we have is an elaborate device carved upon it a man and a woman are you kidding me a man and a woman respectful elegant royalty oh so they are royalty we even see the no we don't see the isle of val i don't i i don't know but they weren't able to contact the students of baldastian i think they somewhat mention it's on an island i think There we go, the royalty. Precisely who these individuals are we cannot say, nor do we know whether the device actually serves a purpose. Like as not, it is purely decorative. Wait, it's just mandatory for you, like a crystal tower. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. If you're thinking to force it, save your strength, it's no use. Just ask the Kellyers uh, on my hand. Oh, come on, man. Don't you realize it? Rest assured, we do not mean to waste our strength. Indeed. Why should we exert ourselves when the gate will open of its own accord? So they're royalty. Well, boo hoo, who isn't? I don't think any of us expected that to happen. Seven hells, what is this? What did you do? What? What are you? You aren't royalty. Piercing the heavens and gathering the light, a symbol of mankind's glory and might. A virtue guarded by gates impregnable only to those of royal blood unanswerable. Exactly as passed down through the legend, I am delighted to see. No fucking way. Is he going to be maskless? Or is he going to pretend like... Yeah, he actually is maskless. Beg your pardon for the intrusion, your bewilderment. For interrupting your bewilderment. I couldn't help but notice the remarkable playthings you have acquired. That face, dude. Hero? Still alive? No, a stupid question, isn't it? Garland, Garland, Garland. I didn't. If I didn't know better, I would say you weren't happy to see me. Ha! <laughs> but I jest. In light of recent meetings, you have every right to be wary. But rest assured, I'm no longer a threat to you. My legion is for all intents and purpose defunctive defunct defunct and more occasion and my occasion association oh with it means 
Uh, a tight noose awaits me back in God. Why? So he failed? Is that it? Why would they hang him? Also, so be roaming this land Eorzea, a regular, uh, regular, a regular interrent. In the course of my wanderings, I chanced to catch wind of the latest venture. It sounded possibly fascinating, and so I decided to come here and join you. After the wrongs you've committed, you think us that gullible. If you are suspicious of my intent, it's only my just deserts. But I am determined to make amend. As a gesture of goodwill, I will share with you what I know, starting with these two old characters. As you are doubtless already aware, the Crystal Tower has a symbol of ancient, elegant might and prosperity. Enter entry was permitted only to royalty and a select few individuals. According to the records I have on earth, only royal blood can open the gate. In other words, the emperor and his prodigy were living keys. You mean to say that these two are descended from elegant royalty? I think you are as well. Oh, uh, I suggest nothing so glamorous. To put it in plain, they are imitation of royalty. Living uh, key born, uh, living keys born of elegant ingenuity. Oh, clones! I believe the name you creators gave your kind. Is that not so? It would seem that the time has. Time for concealment is past. Pray accept our apologies. It was not our intent to deceive. We simply wished to avoid causing undue alarm by prematurely making what may many would consider deranged claims. If it pleases you, let us return to the eight sentinels. There is much and more to tell. No, if I did. I need to check that very well. I had no reason to go to Oranger yet. Um, because I was still having the extreme trials going on. I didn't know there was more. The coils of Bohammed, you mean? Oh, wait. The coils of Bohammed. Of Ultima. Whatever it's called. Seven hells. Do you seriously mean to follow us around? That face, man. I love this character. Come, Garland. You know better, you know me better than you think that I, you know me better than to think I spoke in jest. What more will it take for us to be reconciled? A gift, perhaps? Yeah, I have it. It's, it's a gift. Wow. Wow. The f an eloquent tombstone. I have many of those. It holds the information I just shared with you. A deal more beside. I used to be the jealousy guarded property of the Fourfiend Legion. But it's yours now. If you joy. I wish you joy of it. I'll look forward to working together, old friend. My dogs need to go outside though. So I need to do that. And I definitely have been drinking so much. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm coming, dude. You don't have to start barking. So, um, be right back.
Ok, I'm back. Didn't want to say the name was Borg Borg. Oh, I have it. Um. I think now I know it. Wait. Uh, I've seen it somewhere. Where have I seen it, the coils? I know it. Wait. Huh? I think we might need to go to Uranje then. Okay, let's talk to these guys. Uh, it's under the... No, I don't have it then. I know of it. I, I definitely know of it because there is a six part... Oh, I know it because of the other character. Yeah, now I know. If you are ready to listen, we shall tell... All of you, it is. As it pretends closer to your investigation, your leader Rembrus may wish to be present. Oh, come on, man. Okay, what is this? I skipped a lot of this, by the way. Before we begin, pray allow me to apologize again. It was not our intent to deceive you. As you have already gathered, we are not scholars sent by the students of Abadastian. Nay, we are clones. Copies of people who once existed. Given life through elegant technology. Ah, uh, this is rather a lot to take in. It would not be considered unseemly. Might I ask why you and yours were created? And more specifically... What it, what is it that you now seek to do? Answering your question requires that we revisit elegant history. Pray bear with us. The elegant empire reached its zenith long before your kin, uh, kind came into being. In that glorious age, the Crystal Tower stood tall as a symbol of elegant pride. Parents took their children there, that they might learn how to... Nig limitless energy. It produced uh, broad prosperity to the whole empire. Its prosperity, however, bred... De de decadence? Decadence? Bred decadence? And the empire began to show signs of stagnation. This decline was made. This decline. This decline was made all the more rapid for what of for want of strong leadership. In a matter of generation, the elegant civil civilization became a pale shadow of its former self. It once gleaming cities fell into disrepair and its form frontier lands were given over to the wilderness. What? What? That makes no sense. Laminating the pitiful state of affairs, our technology made it... Technologists make it a mission to restore elegant to greatness. Among, Among was his name and he believed that the aligning empire... Ailing empire... Wanted for but a potent ruler, and none was more potent than its founding father, whom he sought to resurrect. Founding father? You cannot mean Emperor Alexander. Uh, Alexander, yeah. None other. As part of his experiment, an uncreated clones of the Emperor's des uh, descendants, uh, descendants, my god. We are products of that experiment. Copies of. My face now. Of. Uh, Unai and Doga. Historical texts mention the reign of two elegant empires named 
two elegant empires named Sande. Why two? It was commonly believed that the second was the namesake of the first after all. M such a custom is not uncommon among royalty and commoners alike. To think that the two were in fact one and the same. Aye. Alexander uh, returned from the grave and assumed his throne once more. And true to Amon's predic prediction, the Empire restored his realm to its glory it once knew. Would that he could have been satisfied with that. Okay. In his previous life, the Empire desired to bring the entire world under the domain uh, of elegant dominion, an ambition that ultimately went unfulfilled. Having been granted a second chance, he was determined to succeed. Realizing that he needed more power to wage his war of conquest, Xander returned his strength towards a forbidden source, darkness. In order to learn how to harness this, this power, he converted the Crystal Tower into a restricted research facility. Oh yeah, he loves that. Darkness. Again. Seven Hells. What's with the megalomanical rulers turning into dark turning to darkness in their loss for power? Well, at least we this one won't be bothering us. Being thousands of years dead, no, I don't think he died. Would that you were right, Master Garland. Are you gotta be kidding me, man? This is how we made the new Hondas? I don't get it. You'll have to explain it to me. And as Power Sander is very much alive, within Cyrus Tower, he still abides his ambition, burning all the more ardently. For his empire's collapse. Man, this story is weird. Building the power of darkness requires prodigious amount of energy. Energy that not even a crystal tower could produce. In order to augment the shortfall, Dalamund was cr Dalamund. Yeah, there we go. So the sun was created and launched into the heavens. On high it, hang, uh, it hung, gathering the sun's energy and channeling it into the tower below. However, a miscalculation resulted in a surge of energy that escaped into the land. It triggered an earthquake of unprecedented violence, the calamity that ushered the fourth umbral era. In a blink of an eye, the mighty elegant empire was laid to waste. Yet, even as the crystal tower was sinking into the earth, the technologist Am Amon, now Emperor Zande's closest aide, invoked powerful magitex and halted the flow of time. Every soul within the structure, the, empires inclu the emperor, emperor included, was placed into a deep sl slumber? In that state, they were. Uh, they uh, in a st in that state, they were to remain until the time was ripe to awaken. Empire awoken. Yeah, that's the moon. That's the artificial moon that also came down during like the 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 realm reborn or something. Eros came and went. After millennia lying dormant, Dalamund was summoned back to Earth. Its descent, descent triggered the Seven Umbral Calamity, in the wake of which the Crystal Tower re-emerged. Is that the guy? He's huge! For, um, for that moment, Emperor Exander awakened. In his lust for power, the Emperor consorted with darkness and was subdued seduced by its corrupting influence. Even though his empire is now little more than a fading memory, he will stop at nothing to see his ambition realized. But you can do it differently. But they were huge!
This for no other purpose than to put an end to Xander's madness that we exist. This is the mantle we have inherit, inherited from our namesakes, the true Unai and Doga. Fearing what might befall the world, the two of them sought to twirl, thwart their emperor. They gave upon us their will that we might carry on their mission should they fail. Well, God, they failed. When we came to our senses within the Crystal Tower, we deliberated a course. We deliberated a course of action, concluding that we alone could not overcome Xander. We struck out to find worthy ally. It has taken years, but our search is finally over. It's an ordinary woman that can cut through a path through the labyrinth of the ancient. With you as your champ, with you as our champion, Une. We are confident that we can end Xander's dark ambitions once and for all. I never read this story. That's why I'm so happy that I restarted this. Well, that teaches me to speak too soon. Setting my chagrin aside, I see now why you knew about the students of Baldassian amongst a host of other things. You were observing our investigation the whole time. So, what will we do in it? The world's in grave danger again and it's just so happened you're the expert at saving it. You have our eternal gratitude to get a let us see to the elegant empire's dark past laid to rest. It's kinda sad, isn't it? An empire so great, so advanced, destroying itself because of they wanted to be greedy too much. It has been our mission to recover the long last knowledge of the elegant civilization. But what's worth but what's worth is that knowledge if it means subjugating the realm to peril. Truth be told, it pains me to think that the tower secrets may become lost to us, but the greater good must ever come first. Besides, no quantity of ancient relics can compare to our friends Unai and Doga. Living, breathing elegance. Sounds a lot like humanities, yeah, true. And so I hereby declare a change to Noah's objective. Henceforth we shall direct all efforts towards sealing off uh, the, the tower. Its dark secrets must never know the light of day. I, I think our other friend might be disappeared already. You know, as you did with, uh, for us within the Labyrinth of Ancient, I would have you enter the structure and eliminate hostile elements. Suffice to say, this includes the Emperor himself. Meanwhile, the rest of us shall examine ways to isolate the tower from the outside world. To work then. Oh, yeah, he's not going to be okay with that. Wait, there's something I must know. My right eye is like yours. Does does this mean no you just You inherited trait from your father, you said. Know what uh, that clones are unable to bre uh, to bear offsprings. You have no cause for concern. But the elegant eye you call it but to us it is the royal eye owing to the fact that the traits manifest only to those possessed of royal blood so you are of royal blood i cannot well explain why the eye runs in your line but i am disinclined to think it a coincidence coincidence though you are doubtless impatient to learn the truth pray have patience all will be revealed in due time
apologies. If I've given you cause to worry, I'm quite well. I assure you, as you can as you can appreciate, there has been that there, there has been much for me to think on. Yeah, of course. But now it's time for action. No idle thoughts. Cyrus Towers awaits us. Can we? I actually enter the raid now. Your task is to eliminate all hostile elements within the structure. Sander himself included. This will afford us the chance to seal off the facility. May the crystal grant you strength. Um, that all said, like, when we are done with this upcoming raid, uh, that's it for me. I need some sleep before my night shift. And I still need to, like, dinner, the, the dogs, sleep, pick up the wife, change clothes, get stuff together, and go to work. So, yeah, we're definitely entering the crystal tower so uh like like uh hopefully how many of these 161, that's nothing. Hopefully this goes as fast as the other one. That would be nice. That's not done. those who first discovered it. Modern scholars have yet to discover why discover not only what the catalyst agent contains but exactly how it functions. Understanding only that the substance is required to strengthen the properties of a certain material. Yeah, that, that, that kind of looks cool. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, I guess. Oh, damn. Very nice. What's up with the flickering? Um, nope. Oh yeah, that's cool. I like that. I like that. Looks like a damn paintball rifle. Oh, I like this one.
Oh, red. That's a danger. That's a different color now. Oh. Hmm. It's also, it's, it's only like high level 50, so it's absolutely like nothing too fancy. I'll take a look in a second. Quite like the red weapons more than the blue ones. These, I think these would break your wrist. Okay, so Wolverine. Yeah, I like the... I really like the reddish. <sighs> I don't know, man. It's so tiny. Come on, man. Where's the huge bloody shield? That's better. Yeah, these are earrings. No, no way I'll test all of these out. Uh, scepters, rods. Oh, fuck yeah. That's cool. That's really cool. Wait. I think this is easier for you guys to see, right? <laughs> Look at this, man. That is absolutely amazing. Him. A minion? Wind up Chromera? Oh, here's the books. I'm missing a bit of the oof. You know, like it's actually cool. Like, I. I How can books be cool, right? Uh, let's take a look. So we have... Try that. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That is so bloody good. That is so nice. Heart of the Vortex. Yeah, these are cool. I like that. Well, it seems like we're not going to get luck with these uh, with this particular raid. So I'll uh, I'll take the stuff into the glam chest. I'm hoping it will 
trigger. Like right now would be nice. Oh, nice. I should check out weapons more. I didn't do that in my first run. I... Uh, oh, whoa, there's a buttload of stuff going into chat right now. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Uh, I like the others more. See who's actually online. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, let's ask the FC. Or Sai Power. It is the 24 man. 24 man. Great. And once again, it's gloomy. Join us in the FC for brunch. Alright, oh, yeah, that's funny. The FC house. Go check it out then. Yeah, I don't think it's triggering, guys. Is hilarious. Yep, there we go. FC brunch. Unfortunately, guys, I think that this is uh, this is this might be where we uh, we need to end. I'm not seeing this happening. Uh, we don't have DPS, we got tanks, we got to a the, the average waiting time was 8, now it's 12. It's busy today. Look at that, nice, I like that. Let's take a look. I like that. Oh. Bloody cat on the table. Get that cat on the table. No. Daily reset is also in five minutes. Really?
Oh, uh, okay, okay. See if it pops. So five minutes is... There we go. <laughs> What's up with this? Oh, that's a stove. Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah, that looks good. Like that. Pointing in the wrong way. <laughs> oh, that seems interesting way of sitting there, Nadia. <laughs> the chair itself. See if it pop. Yeah. Ah. Uh, waiting for. Reset, do, do, great, then finish, stream. <laughs> Just like that, right out the edge of the table. Oh yeah, that that's funny. <laughs> My dogs are also extremely active. Buddy, what's up? What's up? Work economy. Oh, it's actually going about economy and stuff. It is a brunch. Talking about a bunch of stuff. What's up, buddies? Okay, uh, reset in a minute. Hopefully. By the looks of it, at five. Let's see if this will trigger. Yeah, my dogs are restless. I definitely need to stop after this raid. Okay, it should be reset it, right? Yeah, it's resetting. Which one would people do first? If I was doing these, I would start with my leveling quest and my, my seals quest and I'll think about the raid later. Or do you think people usually just go with the raid? I'm not going to sit here for like 30 minutes. So, I think we'll have to leave this till next week.
You like the other ones? What other ones? Oh, the later Alliance raids. Like, it's not like they can select it, right? Like, there's currently a group that we have, like, in, in the Duty Finder. Oh. oh I'm sorry to hear that. I thought it was fun, actually. Then again, what do I know? Oh, seriously? Is this crystal that much hated? Yeah, okay. That, that's right, it's a cluster, f absolutely cluster fuck on what's going on. I cast like five healing spells, yeah. True. Yeah. Yeah, I get it. That's 3,650. Uh, but if you include... It's actually not correct. There's two days that are included because of um, how our calendar is, is set up, right? Every four or five years, we get an additional day, which would be the, f the 29th of February. I don't know how to call it in English. So it would actually be 3,652 days. Or maybe 53, depending on when you start it. It could never be 4. Leap days, okay. In in Dutch, it's called um, uh, een schrikkeljaar. Okay, so in English, it's a leap day, a leap year, which I think I don't know for sure. Let me check that. I think it's next year. Yeah, next year. Next year is a leap year. We have 29 days in 2024, in February. Every four, yeah, every four years. Yeah, next one. Uh, I'll wait until we hit 8 minutes. If we don't have it, then I'm definitely calling it because I don't... I, I can't wait forever, right? Does Dutch translation literally... do like something calendar? Nee, I don't even know what the word stands for, schrikkel. I don't know, I need to look that up. Apparently, our word is from a 14th century 
world as like to Shrek something like a giant leap or giant step Man, my language is weird dude Shrelcha Actually, I think that would probably be the translation. Yeah, it is actually the translation to Schrickel. So... How was all of your day? Well, the day's been good. Day been good. About to log for a nap, then night shift. Yeah, it's not happening, guys. I'm sorry. I'm going to be pulling out. Never mind. There we go. That was lucky. I was absolutely logging out. We made a whole world by throwing someone out of the window. Yeah, it is definitely Murphy's Law. It's not happening, guys. Like it new. Like it knew. Yeah. Did not expect that. Oh, could you stop whining, please? Jesus, dude. Ah, well, sounds good. It's time to look. So annoying today, one of my dogs. I don't know what his problem is. Uh, this time we're Alliance A. Wait. Oh, no, it is different. So I'm going to assume he is going to be pulling everything together. Alright, let's go. Let's start spamming stone. It's like the same dragon. Oh, do retainers, then Q. Ah, oh, okay, okay. Well, that makes sense. Love how that effort looks. Doesn't matter where I go, which way I go on. Jesus Christ, he's making so much noise. No, it doesn't seem like it actually matters. Gathering will be sealed off in 15 minutes, uh, 15 seconds. Um, it seems like these balls are very dangerous.
I kind of don't want to be hit by anything. Oh, he's not moving. Okay, there's a staff. Do I focus on it? Uh oh. God, what the fuck's going on? I have no clue what's going on, dude. Then again, boss is almost down, so nobody cares. Yeah, let's not worry about mechanics, I guess. Need. Great. really remember doing this dungeon to be absolutely fair okay, let's huddle up huddle up oh he's a very cool uh, weapon all right we got a dragon So has a very cool weapon, the black mage in our party. I'll take a look at it. To find him. At least this guy. Oh yeah, that does look nice. Oh no, I don't know. No, this there was this um this guy with a green side. Him there. Um Di Dinet, Dinet. Um who is definitely not in our group. The the green weapon. Mechanics really don't do anything anymore, do they? I'm very curious on how these things look and I'm hoping I'll get all of them. So I'll be doing these raids uh, to get some of these items because I think they can look absolutely amazing.
I don't see how a dragon can be a elegant machine like technology. That might be me. Oh, seriously, this dog is driving me crazy again. Like I love the I love him, really, I do, but oh he is such a whiner. Defeat Anon. Oh, this is the guy. Oh, he kind of looks dead. Time has not been kind on Anon. So he is the guy who resurrected the Emperor and created the clones. I think we need to kill these. Uh, one of those experiments actually got there. What the hell is this? Yeah, I don't think I... I, I know I've probably done it once, but... To unlock the rest. I can't really remember this one. Wait, what the fuck? Was I just drawn outside of hiding? Priest die. Okay, all of them are still alive. Take a look. Read. I don't know why if I need those pots. I really don't. I'll just take them because I'm greedy as hell. So this is the king. Not so good King Mog. Well, I... Time has not been gentle for you, sir. I like these fights actually, even though maybe the crystal tower not the best series, I still like the fights. I, I, it makes kinda it makes sense, right? Not throwing in the most difficult raids right off the start with the most mechanics. Oh. I saw something happening, I just assumed I had to stand into that uh, damn circle. Oh wait, what the hell?
That's one way you get my entire party. Get any platforms now again, or yeah, there we go. Whoa. I don't know how I was pulled off of that as well. Well, King died. Bye bye. Oh, I seriously need to change that pose. Oh gee, I wonder how. I'm getting the sarcasm, but I'm not sure why. I wonder who else was in your party. I don't know. Yeah, okay, but why... I was pulled off that platform, I don't know why, because I actually got damage from that. Oh, okay. You did it, you defeated the Emperor. Empires may rise and fall, but man in defatigable spirit ever lives on. Truly, you are a champion we had hoped for. You know? With Emperor Xander now, uh, uh, now at eternal rest, his dark legacy can be undone. Yeah, yeah, I don't know about that, man. Look at him going all clad again. What are you playing at now, Nero? In case you haven't noticed, Garland, these are dangerous surroundings. Can a man be at fault for exercising due caution? At any rate, you didn't tell me. I'm perfectly capable of looking after myself. Go on and finish what you came to do. There are two ways that we may seal the tower off. Either isolate it from the outside world or cripple its ability to produce energy. The choice of method is yours to make. Before we proceed, however, Doga and I must need attempt to a task. Uh, 
was seeing if I could pull you off without interrupting stone cast and when you you better to practice than level 50 area but it doesn't matter if you die oh okay I think I actually did cast stone I don't know if, if it, I don't think it was interrupted that distortion what is it It's a rip in time, and we all die now. Cast is interrupted though. Black mate, no, I don't think so. The paths and the sought to obtain comes from the void. The world of darkness, our people call it. And the true nature of the power was none other than the armies of the void sand. Void sand feed on ether, as you already know. And no plane is richer than it than ours. In exchange for the allegiance, Sender entered into an unholy covenant. He would open a gate through which the Void Sender could freely enter our world. The covenant, I'm afraid to say, is still active. However, be, uh, being of the Emperor's lineages, Una and I believe that we can annul it. By his blood, Sender sealed this uh, dark pact. By our blood, we shall be undone. It shall be undone. It is time. Yes, Doga, finally. We may fulfill our purpose. Look at go, man. He's like... Ha! <laughs> yep. Look at him go, dude. He is going insane. Oh, be still, my beating heart. For a moment I feared that this outing would end in disappointment, but my readings were not mistaken. Not even the ultimate weapon compared to this. What are you going on about? The Covenant is everlasting. They can't shut it down. Well, that's nice. Wait, there these... There the guys that... What the... And so Mericidia is brought into the fold. Soon all the world shall be united under elegant rule. And yet, with every dream that comes reality, the memory of death grows even more vivid. An endless void, the threat of light and warmth. Though I may have defeated death, I did not it did not leave me unscathed. Nay, it reveling claws have Scarred my soul for eternity. Never shall I know peace. What is this? Do being uh, beings without will, you cannot foretell my rage, my melancholy, my fear. That worth is wealth and power. Uh, what worth? Is wealth and power when all must inevitably be, con be consigned to nothingness. If man has nothing, he need not know the pain of loss. So let there be nothing. Seriously, this guy is cuckoo. Harvest more power than the gate may... Uh, that the gate may be torn full open. Let the cloud of darkness come and engulf the world, devouring all life, hopes and dreams. Let all be returned to nothingness.
Where's the rest? Oh no, pull yourself together. Is there no end to them? What in the seven hells is happening? Ah, oh, not now, damn it. Wait, what weapon? Wait, he is a... He's a gunbreaker. Cool. Well. Very effective weapon, though. Oh, man, I didn't want him. Go away. Nero. They... Uh, were they part of your grand plan too? Save you, Yabba's garment. I did not put up with your arrogant face to play with worthless clones. Something controlling them, a void sent, and no ordinary one at that. Doga. Wait, Doga? Well. One down. Gunbreaker is one of the few. Okay. Well. Confound it. Without them, there's no way to master the darkness. That power is mine. He's jumping in. Wait, what? Yeah, that's what he wanted. I guess. The Covenant shall be honored. I am the cloud of darkness. I shall devour your light and return to this world and shall and return this world to the void. Freaking sense, dude. Well, that's easy. Damn it, the rift is gone. What are we supposed to do now? Seal the tower off. <laughs> as much as it pains me to leave uh, without them, there, there's precious little we can do. Let us return. To the uh, to the find and consult rumbers. Yeah, if we see a skill being cast, we need to move ASAP. Otherwise, we will actually get damage from it. Uh, I'm not going to be talking to Rembrus right now. I do want to take a quick look at what it is that I actually had, I've actually got. Wait, oh. Okay. Wait, what? Is that a weapon? I thought it was a pants. Yeah, it is legs. Well, well, I can't really see it. And I'm not going to wear it without them. Also pants. Oh shit, did not mean to do that. Can I remove them again? I don't kind of don't want them from on. Well, it has more mind. And so is this. Might as well indeed equip it. Whatever. What else do we have? Try on. That's. That's. I don't know. I don't like it. Use the Onion Knight. Use the other thing. 
You already have added the song to your orchestra list? Really? Oh, I do. Oh, did not pay attention to that. Anyways, guys. That's it for me. Um, you can check it. Uh, I'm not going to be checking my ping right now. Anyways, thank you all so much for being here. I really appreciate that. Uh, I had some fun. I will be back streaming on Monday. I will be playing tonight. So, hey, if you want, add me to your friends list. We can play together. We'll see what happens. Sort the stuff out. And have a great one. Bye-bye. I know you're two having a conversation, but I am actually ending the stream in a second.